There are a couple of ways that we can acquire language. Um, one of them is kind of in a touristic, superficial fashion, and I'm afraid that's what many of us do, uh, even despite our best intentions. But the goal that we have, and I think we must have here at Notre Dame, is to educate ourselves, and above all our students, to the level of cultural insider. Does it mean you have to be fluent? No, most of us will never quite be that. I'm fluid, but I, people would not over time uh, mistake me for a native speaker. Uh, and, and that's okay, that's the way it is. But what I have and what I try to give to my students and what the entire program does is that possibility to become a participant in the conversation in the native language. So if they're in a business meeting, even if the re meeting is run in English, as they increasingly are, they can kind of get what's going on during those important hallway discussions, uh, and they will be appreciated for, for having that ability. They can read the newspaper. They can go to the theater. These are all things you can only do if you're a cultural insider. So please don't ever believe uh, what some people say, and some very influential people uh, will tell you you don't need a, a language anymore. This is not self-pleading. Uh, you know, it's, it's actually true. Uh, you'll be in a much better position, not only if you're an academic, but just to be an educated citizen of the world, uh, working in business, working in, in public policy, uh, or indeed academia. Uh, you will never regret having uh, that additional level of uh, ability to communicate in another language.